Oh, Ms. McCauley, thank you for that. Um, Secretary, I just make the comment that uh, messaging is important, but at the end of the day, what the Australian people expect is that governments who are responsible for um, aviation regulation uh, will find a way to work with state and local governments so that the outcome is not just messaging but is consistent safety. And, and I raised Jandicop before as a case where we see those concerns around the encroachment uh, for the airport. The, the second area I just wanted to get an assurance that you have taken on board. Um, I know that the department's position is that CASA provides a safety uh, input into master plans. Uh, we discussed probably 18 months ago uh, at Estimates Archerfield and the role that CASA played there in signing off on the shortened runways, um, but didn't take into account their own requirements and operators in terms of factoring for grass strips, wet strips, climb out, gradients with engine failures, etc., at the gross weight that the operators are currently able to operate at. And so they correctly said it can be safe but that would require the operators to operate it with lower payloads, uh, hence not as commercially viable. And so, you know, the com discussion we had at the time was that that safety uh, consideration by CASA need to consider the operations as they are in terms of the capacity of the airport and the current aircraft operating there and make sure there is no detriment uh, to that as opposed to saying, yes, it can be safe if you reduce the scope of your operations. Uh, that That is not in the intent of either the lease or the original legis legislation surrounding uh, the use of Commonwealth airports. I agree, Senator. So is that a, an assurance that, yes, you are revising how CASA take their role? Well, we've certainly uh, for some time been looking closely, and I think CASA's uh, engagement in the process is much improved over the last couple of years to what it has been in the past. Mm -hmm. And my final question is, could you perhaps uh, look at providing the committee with a, a briefing of where you're up to with the NASEG uh, process and what you're looking to take to the next meeting uh, so we get some visibility into that before it just becomes a fait accompli that's delivered? Certainly, Senator. We'd be very happy to arrange that through the committee secretary. Okay. Thanks, Chair.